Welcome back to Cosmic Fox ASMR. I am so excited for today's unboxing. I have been waiting patiently and impatiently to purchase two keyboards. Um, and in this video, we are going to be focusing on the mechanical typewriter Bluetooth keyboard for tablets from the brand Yunzi. I think that's how you say it. Uh, so yeah, it's going to be exciting. I love keyboard sounds and if you do, I hope that you <laughs> enjoy me giving a demonstration of the typing noises as well as doing a typewriting test using monkey type. So stick around. Hello and welcome to the unboxing video of the Yunzi Acto B303 Retro Typewriter Bluetooth Keyboard. I am so excited to test this out. I wasn't necessarily expecting to Hello I hope that you are excited <laughs> I'm definitely excited to unbox this typewriter Bluetooth keyboard It is a lovely mint color It has a stand for tablets. I'm very excited. This is the Yunzi branded typewriter keyboard. It is the model Acto B303. I also got the one that it has English and Korean uh, letters on the cap. No particular reason why, I just thought it was interesting. Okay, let's get unboxing. I'm going to guess that these are the extra keycaps. I'm not too sure. It did say that it comes with AAA batteries as well. Um, I didn't know that this ran off of batteries, but I guess it would since it's wireless. I don't know. I thought it was rechargeable. Okay, yeah. Batteries. Extra keycap. Okay. Let's get it out of the box.
fine sounds. I do enjoy that these keys can actually come off, I think. I'm not sure how you pop these off, but you can because obviously we, uh, it came with a red escape key. So that's pretty cool. I wonder if they're going to eventually have, you know, like maybe colored ones that you can switch out. I would definitely enjoy that. <laughs> so a little bit about this keyboard. Uh, it's Bluetooth. It works with any phone or tablet. doesn't matter if it's Windows, Android, iOS. Uh, yeah, it can connect with it. And the way that you do it is you press the FN function key and then K, which has the Bluetooth symbol. And it will flash to show that it is in pairing mode. I've already um, did it because it took me a while to figure out how to connect it. There weren't any instructions that I know maybe they were in a different language so I couldn't read it but I eventually figured it out so I'm going to position the camera so that you can see me doing some typing tests on the tablet let's get started okay so a little bit more information about this keyboard um, which I forgot to state was that this uh, holder right here is where you would put your tablet or phone for connection. It is 12 inches, so it can fit a decent amount of tablets on here. Mine is a 10, 10 and a half inch, I think, or maybe it's 11 and a half. I can't remember. Quite roomy in there. Um, it is 0.59 inches wide. Uh, I do have a case on my tablet which has, um, you know, like a flip cover which can also be folded into a stand, um, but that is a little bit too thick to stick in here, so I flipped the tablet over so that folding part doesn't actually get in the way. Um, it might be because I had it actual folded into a stand. Um, yeah, it, fit, it fits fine, just not on this uh, where the closure part is. But yeah, good thing with tablets, you can have them whichever way, you know. It could be long ways or sideways. I'm going to have it sideways though for this demonstration. And let's open up monkey type. Caps log. Interesting. Oh. Okay. Um, I've heard of a little trick that I want to try out. If you press escape and then type toggle, you should be able to have a little monkey typing with you. And it actually like does different things depending on your speed. So cute, so I want to try and get it, but um, I don't know, it's not, uh, it's not letting me do it with the touch function for some reason. Give me that monkey. Monkey. <laughs> okay, well, I can't get the monkey to show up, so we're just going to start.
words per minute count is um, not that great, <laughs> uh, but at least I got 100% accuracy, so, you know, that was only the first time. I can try again, see if I'm a little bit faster. <laughs> Let's see, uh, how do I? Yay! I did do a little bit better and I still got 100% accuracy. Nice. Uh, what else? Consistency, 74%. I think that was at 60 something the first time. 30 second session. Oh, I thought it. Oh, I didn't even realize I didn't set the, uh, the time. I was thinking 60 seconds, but. There's a way to customize monkey type as well, but uh, I'm still new to monkey type, so I will be playing around with it later on, which will be a lot of fun for me because I think that the keyboard sounds are quite nice on this typewriter, even though it's not mechanical. They feel very comfortable. Um, it's easy to use. I do like the little... It, it's got like a, a bit of a, a soft cushiony type of feel when you press down. Overall, I am definitely happy with this purchase. I would highly recommend that if you are looking for a typewriter style Bluetooth keyboard, Yunzi is the way to go. I did do my research. I was looking for a typewriter style Bluetooth keyboard for quite a while, and there were a few choices out there. There's not really that many choices, but um, I'm definitely happy with what I settled on. So, highly recommend if this is something that you are looking for. Anyways, I had lots of fun demonstrating this. I hope that you enjoyed it. And until next time, I hope you have a good morning, a good evening, 